So tonight I went to my friend Jeff, my little brother Jeff, I call him, right? Because he's been like my little brother for a long, long time. I went to his house for supper, right? But respecting the social distance and everything, he's really good at that. So him, his son, and his mother sat at one end of the table and I got to sit at my own special table. But I was so thankful to be invited. The last time I only saw him in the driveway, right? You guys, if you know someone that doesn't have a bubble, let them burst your bubble or whatever, right? Like, let them come over. I was telling his mom, right, that I watch on TV that it's the loud talkers, right? That, you know, is more than six feet. So, you, Jeff had said it could be like, I think people who sing and stuff, that could be nine feet, right? So I told her, do you want me to go sit next to her? I can go sit at their kitchen table. Because <laughs> that's me. <laughs> I tried to talk low, I did, right? I did. And I was at my own table and I behaved. And I had a wonderful meal and it was so nice, right? And now I'm going to go get my bus and I'm going to go to work. So, you know, you got to include other people, right? Because it's important to have that human interaction and not everyone has someone right or might not have someone that's here right now right so be good to each other and take care of each other that's it i love you guys i'm at jeff's for supper and i'm already at my table this is what i get i'm not allowed to be at the big table but i, I get this i'm allowed in the home look at me i even got my own supplies how fun is this? He's got to put, like, you know when people snow blow and they have that plastic <laughs> thing over? That's what he sees gone. He's going to put that on me. <laughs> I love it here. I love it here. My sleepover.